in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to make skija i'm a piano like sam deep right here on alpha studio mobile and guys the good news is that i'm going to be giving away this hot sam deep project file to you guys for free yes guys absolutely for free but guys before you download this hot alpha studio mobile project file make sure that you subscribe and watch this video carefully because in this video i'm going to be giving you guys the unlock password for the alpha studio project file okay guys let's get right into it Okay guys, so this is how I made a same deep type beat on FL Studio Mobile guys. It was quite simple. So guys, let me quickly show you guys on how I did it. So what we're gonna start with are my shaker loops and then this is how they sound like guys. Nice and simple. And then if I can get into these shaker loops, you can see them that they are like this inside. Nice and simple guys. And then guys, moving on to my next instrument, I have the bass wobbly. And then this is how it sounds like guys. And then guys inside the bass wobbly. This is how it looks like. This is how I did everything guys. Nice and simple. Okay guys, moving on to my next instrument, I have the second wobbly bass and then which sounds like this after this one. This one guys is deeper than the first one and this is how it looks like inside the piano. Nicely done guys, I kept it nice and simple. Moving on to my next instrument guys, I have my purity strings and then this is how they sound like nicely done guys i usually turn down their volume this is how they sound like so i put it somewhere there guys so that my quality of the beat could increase because if you open the volume out loud it might destroy your quality of your beat guys so make sure you keep the strings low and then guys inside the edit section i tripled my strings i used the c5 note i used the top note and this lower note all in all guys they sound like this nice and cool guys so that's why i triple my strings guys so they can sound super cool okay guys moving on to my next instrument let me quickly highlight this spot like this i have the ttc bass which sounds like this Just like that guys, it sounds like that and I kept it nice and simple with the TTC bass guys, just like this. Okay guys, moving on to my next three instruments guys, I have the most popular instrument here, the charts guys, the charts and then this is how they look like in the edit section and then... This is how I placed my charts guys, nice and simple and pretty cool. So 
super hot guys so that's how i used my chords here and then basically guys the chords that i'm using are called the vcf chords and then that's how i did them guys i just totally made it creative i just used different notes so that it can sound super cool guys i hope you're enjoying this tutorial okay guys moving on to my second my fourth instrument i think yep this is the fourth one it's this vcf bass and then it sounds like this And then guys this is how it looks like inside and it sounds like this nicely done guys and then this is how it sounds like super hot guys moving on to my next instrument guys i have the d tune the most popular instrument in my piano the d tune guys so this is how I used my D tune. Nice and simple guys. And guys, the next instrument I've used here guys is the solo accordion. And then this is how it sounds like guys. It's an orchestral thing that improves the quality of my beat and then this is how it sounds like with the whole thing guys let me quickly play it for you guys it adds that same deep effect guys so that's how i use the orchestra nicely done guys super hard guys moving on to the hottest instrument in the whole beat the log drums guys so what i'm gonna do to play the log drums guys is that i'm gonna and mute other things and then we're gonna start playing this part of the log drum guys so what i'm gonna do now is that i'm gonna take this little thing here pull it somewhere there and then let's start playing our log drums guys so what i'm gonna do is do this and then let's play our log drums and see how they sound guys Nice and hard, guys. And then this is how my log drums look like inside the piano. Nice and hard, guys. And guys, the reason why my log drums hit hard is because of I used a secret, guys. That if you can click here, I use the leveler, as you can see it. If I can turn down the level, you can hear the log drums are not loud themselves. But adding the leveler and then increasing the volume of it, it makes your log drums to hit hard, guys. So that's the trick I use in here, guys. Hope you guys have learned a lot on this tutorial, guys. And then, all in all, guys, my instruments, they sound like this. Nice and hard, guys. nicely done guys i totally enjoyed helping you guys on how to make a smd type beat on caustic 3 guys thank you for watching this video make sure that you subscribe and leave a like and click that like button on that video guys and please leave a comment guys i would really appreciate a comment on which video or beat i could make you guys next time because it really helps me a lot so that i can know which problems you guys are facing on apple studio mobile so that i can attend them and then so that guys we can all be good thank you so much guys for watching the tutorial